O God of Israel, great eagle, the gracious, the merciful, Lord of the worlds, who, when he is judged, shall be righteous before thee. For no spirit can reply to thy rebuke nor can any withstand thy wrath. Yet thou bringest all the sons of thy truth in forgiveness before thee in native America, to cleanse them of their faults through thy great goodness, and to establish them before thee through the multitude of thy mercies for ever and ever. O Lord my God, in thee do I put my trust, save me from all them that persecute me, and deliver me, we are the tribes of native America, shine upon your people, the tribes of native America, on our own lands, and restore our sovereignty, all glory and honor to Yahweh, Allah, the Most High, we are the tribes. We are the Yorkets and Mono peoples, and the Alaskan tribes, and the Hawaiian tribes, and the Cherokee, and the Iroquois, and the Navajo, and the Paiute, and the Ute people, and the Apache, and the Odawa, and the Sioux, and the Shoshone, and the Cheyenne, and the Colorado River Indian tribes, and the Ute Mountain Ute tribe, and the Iowa people, and the Irikara, and the Omaha people, and the Crow people, and the Pawnee people, and the Quechan, and the Nez Perce, and the Shawnee tribe and the Salk people, and the Seneca Cuyuga Nation, and the Meskwaki, and the Juanano, and the Esalen, and the Cumuai, and the Little Shell Tribe of Chippeway Indians of Montana, and the Matil, and the Rappahannock people, and the Biloxi people, and the Chumash people, and the Yakima, and the Pima people, and the Osage Nation, the Kikabu, the Iowe, the Oto, the Ponca, the Kaw, and the Huma people, and the Citizen Potawatomi Nation, and the Wyandot Nation, and the Fort Sil Apache, and the Modoc Nation, and the Delaware Nation, and the Chaos, and the Hidatsa, and the Sac and Fox Nation, and the Ho-Chunk, and the Great Sioux Nation, and the Mohawk, and the Mandan, and the Yavapay Prescott Tribe, and the Kuliwe, and the Louis Ano, and the Paom Korachim, and the Kahula, and the Kuapiho, and the Kikopa, and the Papai, and the Kiliwand, the Lakota, the Pascuayaki Tribe, and the Miwok, and the Porch Band of Creek Indians, and the Wampanoag people, the people of the first light, with you, O God of Israel, great eagle, is the excellent reward, the gardens of Eden, promised by the most merciful to his servants in the unseen, his promise will certainly come true, blessed art thou, O Lord of hosts, Amen. This is April Shaltais, using the computer to generate this message. My brother, Rendell Barry Shaltais, is dead. My brother, Todd Perry Shaltais, is dead. My niece, Celeste Shaltais Conway, is dead. All dead, immoral people, today, are still using genocide for gain and amusement. They want me dead, too. This is Rome, and they decided to put me down. They don't need a reason, but I am an unmarried virgin past 50. I survived. So they are calling me a botched kill and they want to clean up the mess and finish the job. They don't want me to have any more birthdays. They poisoned my dogs. They used COVID as an excuse to take away my job, my health insurance, my phone, my internet. They blocked my 403b money and my retirement. They cut my power. They denied my unemployment. They also attacked my vehicles, disabling them and trying to tow them, again and again. This is April shall ties, and I want to live, not die for any reason, for with long life the Lord will satisfy me. This is Rome, and Rome wants you to die in the arena. Rome is still here. Rome crucified Christ and created Christianity to cover up the genocide of Jews, Africans, Muslims, Russians, Irish, Celts, Japanese, Chinese, Aborigines, Vietnamese, Koreans, Hmong, Hawaiians, Eskimos, Native Americans, and more. Mexicans are dying on the border every day. Never, never forget, never. The scriptures say, Lord of the worlds, you are our true master. Unquestionably, yours is the judgment, and you are the swiftest of reckoners. Children of Israel, cease not to cry unto the Lord our God for us, that he will save us. This is April Shell Ties. Did you know that statistics show that a higher number of deaths from COVID impacted groups who have suffered genocide? Statistics show COVID is targeting specific groups deemed undesirable in the past, groups that were subjected to extermination efforts, enslavement, and genocide. Groups like Jews, Africans, and Native Americans. Groups like the young and the elderly. Is COVID another genocide? Research it yourself and come to your own conclusions. 
This is Rome. Rome is into conquest and killing. Rome invaded Europe and came to Native America, where it continued its practices of enslavement, assimilation, and genocide. The forgotten genocide of Native Americans on this continent was not forgotten by God, was, not, forgotten, by God. The scriptures say, O Yahweh, Allah, the Most High, you are the best of providers. Glory be to you, you are the knower of the hidden.